Well, what a game we have in store for you today. The hype has been building all week and the fans are pouring into the stadium. The tension palpable. It's Real Madrid and they take on Barcelona. It's coming up live next on EA TV. Hello and welcome, and I can tell you it was a dry walk to the gantry today, no rain in sight. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position, and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. An action coming up from the Spanish top division, La Liga. It's Real Madrid facing Barcelona. Thanks Derek, well this should be a decent game today. Both managers will have a game plan, both teams have a certain style of play, and both sides will want to start quickly. I'm looking forward to this. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is the keeper of choice. Antonio Rudiger plays alongside Eder Militao in central defence. Vinicius Jr. starts with Rodrigo out wide. And the main striker today is Kylian Mbappe. And the Barcelona shape looks like this. Well, although it's down as a 4-5-1, it's more likely to be three players in behind the main centre forward. And those three are key to this team's creativity. And they kick off here. Rafinha. Considering the form book, Stuart, Kylian Mbappe has got to be taken seriously here. Well, it's his pace that makes him the standout player today. Whether he's running at defenders with the ball or making runs into space, he's very hard to stop. I'm sure he's going to have a big influence on this game today. And Barca moving the ball with purpose. And possibilities inside the box. past him Danny Olmo takes the shot an early goal it is the ideal opening well I think everybody knew what was coming but he hit it so well, didn't he? Nobody could do anything about it. That's a good goal. So Real restart the game. Disappointed to have conceded. Can they find an equaliser? Rodrigo. Rudiger. Here's Carvajal. Valverde. Is with Vinicius Junior. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence.
Payne to beat. Danny Olmo. Well, here it is again, and the striker does everything right. He hits it across the goalkeeper, which makes it difficult for him. And then the player coming in is alert for the rebound. What a good goal that is. Well, Ancelotti knows his team just haven't been at it today. His reaction says it all. Just look at his face. So the ball rolling again. 2-0 the score. Can he deliver it with accuracy? A goal! And it's very much game on here! Well, let's see it again, because the delivery is absolutely perfect. Hard and low, just inviting someone to run onto it. And the movement is good, making for a comfortable finish. It's a really great goal. On they go again, and I wonder, can Real push for a leveller here? Pedri. This is Robert Lewandowski. Rafinha. And teammates to play it to. Giving them a different option by moving in field. But really sticking to the task defensively. That is how to apply the pressure. Kunde. Now to Stegen. Balde. And the referee has given the advantage to Barca. A spot on with that challenge. Well, that's been deemed offside, and maybe, Stuart, we could accuse him of being rather greedy. Yeah, that's sloppy play. All he had to do was let the ball run through to his teammate there. Danny Olmo. Showing a real will to win the ball. Out of play, Real Madrid throw here. Ball played nicely. Carvajal. And the attack carried promise, but petered out. Kunde. Barcelona free kick. It'll be here. And Sufati. Under real pressure here. Is it going to be? 
And that looked as though it was going to be his second. Well, he scored and looked a real nuisance throughout the game. That could so easily have been another goal for him. And over it comes. And the keeper able to hold on to it. Rodrigo. Ansu Fati. Ansu Fati. Fati. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Jude Bellingham. And now Rodrigo. Oh, chance perhaps. Magnificent stuff. And quite the comeback from two goals down. Well, this is a brilliant strike, as you can see. He hits it with so much power, the keeper had no chance. Fantastic finish. Well, that picture says it all. His team are back in the game now. Really got to give credit to the entire team because this was a bit like climbing Mount Everest. So a throw in for Real Madrid. And Barcelona have possession again. Well, just look how Lewandowski glides past his opponent, and then Lewandowski's finish is brilliant. He strikes the ball so cleanly and gives the keeper no time to react. It's a really good goal. On with the game then, 3-2, what will happen next? Kylian Mbappe. Robert Lewandowski. Now the counter attack looks on. Well, it looks so promising, but it all comes to nothing. So plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here. And he's hit it with authority. Oh, what a goal! A tremendous strike. Hard to believe that he elected to take on that shot. Absolutely brilliant. Well, as you can see, this catches everybody by surprise. Look where he is when he strikes it. That's a great goal. Well, that's a great reaction, isn't it? Ancelotti's so relieved to be back on level terms here. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. And the electronic board delivers the news. Two minutes of stoppage time. Rodrigo. And nicely struck. And the body in the way. So the whistle then. We're at the halfway stage in this match. Robert Lewandowski illuminating in the first half of this game, Stuart. Well, what an outstanding first half he had. 
He dictated the play and was a constant threat with his ability on the ball. Surely he's going to be marked a lot tighter in the second 45 minutes. Otherwise, he completely dominate the game. And so the second half gets underway. Almost a case of the two teams saying to each other, whatever you can do, I can do just as well. Now breaking at pace, potential danger. Who's left as marker for dead? Valverde. Pedri. Here's Rafinha. Pedri. Barcelona now in potentially a dangerous position. Shows a lot of composure to finish it off. That's a good goal. Well, rather than stop play immediately, the referee waited and now decides on a yellow card. to be the goalkeeper's ball. Kunde. And that'll be a Barcelona ball. says it all just look at his face on the scoreline we see all that's on them by three incisive pass well fantastic reflex action from the goalkeeper to play in a Real Madrid throw-in coming up. Well, no surprise there. Barcelona have enjoyed most of the possession, and that's been because of their ability to win the ball back so quickly. Their pressing has been excellent, and they just haven't stopped working. It's been a fantastic performance up to now.
And played short. Can he find the net? A goal! That's two for him today. They simply can't stop him. No wonder he's celebrating. Well, here it is again. And you have to say, it's the perfect delivery into the danger area. And then what a finish. That's been hit with such power and pace. The keeper has no time to react. It's a brilliant strike. Neither side shy about shooting in this match. Rafinha. Oh, beating his opponent with ease. And a goal to seal the hat-trick. A masterclass in finishing. Just can't stop him today. Look at this again. He's done superbly well to pick out a teammate here. But should the keeper be beaten at his near post? I don't think so. He really needs to do better in those situations. Very really inventive stuff from Real here. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. A gift for any goalkeeper. Kunde. Barcelona have lost possession. Shaping to shoot, and it's two for him today. A masterful performance. The defenders unable to stop him. Well, here's the replay, and just look at that power. That's almost unstoppable. That's a great strike. Rafinha. This is Robert Lewandowski. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. In with a chance. And that's the hat trick. Tearing apart this defence time and again. They simply can't handle it. Well, let's take another look. And wow, how cleanly does he hit that? The keeper was never going to save it. What a good goal that is. And it's level again here. Both sets of fans being put through something of an emotional mangle. Ansu Fati. Lewandowski. Alex Balde, Pedri. You can almost see their opponents racking their brains. How do we stop this? And Sufati. Can he finish this? Oh, yes! It's gone in! And now a chance for them to revel in the moment. Well, as you can see, he beats the defenders so easily with a change of pace, and then it's a decent finish. That's a very good goal, you have to say. Trying to open them up. It could be for Mbappe. And he's only gone and made it a hat-trick. Absolutely unplayable today. What a performance. Well, here it is again. He goes past his marker so easily with just a drop of the shoulder. And all you can do is admire the finish by Mbappe. He hits the ball so clearly. It's a fantastic strike. Well, another equaliser. What a topsy-turvy game this has been. Barca maintain possession. Advantage. And space for them here on the flank. Footwork. Sends it back. Oh, they're going to forge ahead. Oh, incredible save. And he snuffed out any sign of danger. A 
based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. And a yellow card, it's going to be Stewart. Yeah, the ref's got that right. It's a yellow card all day long. Alex Balde, Lewandowski, and level it is in the waning moments, can Barcelona change that situation? Oh, could be an opportunity here. And offside, I rather think he was caught in two minds. Well, he just needed to go elsewhere with his pass. He showed a complete lack of awareness there. Keeping it on the ground, slightly off target, however. Now he must favour the cross. Trying to chisel a chance out of this. Oh, that's top-notch goalkeeping, you've got to say. Now breaking at pace, potential danger. Defenders need to cover. Valverde. And a shot from Mike. Body in the way. Ansu Fati. Rafinha. Balde. And one to run for Barca on the wing. And options in the centre. Giving him a different option by moving in field. Gone out, and it is going to be a goal kick. completely missed time and you would expect a booking under the circumstances well the referee has taken note of his name and number well I think he can count himself a bit unlucky there but it was certainly a foul Electronic board has been held in the air, and we're going to have a minimum of four added minutes. Can they push ahead? Yes, is the answer, and that could be all oh, so important. Well, let's take another look, and it's a very good goal. That you have to say, they've been excellent. Here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so cleanly. It's a great goal. And level again here. 
this has been quite the roller coaster ride. Well, the referee blows the whistle, nothing to divide them after 90 minutes.